Lord Hobbs of Laslin resisted Revolupius, who had usurped the throne, but his dominion was taken by the Archim Legion. However, Laslin was freed again by the Founder's Order, led by Captain Da Vinci, and the Laslin Allied Resistance Forces were founded here. This was once the most prosperous granary in Laslin, but after the cursed rain came, it became infested with strangely enlarged pests. People tried to solve the problem by employing the power of free wizards, but the free wizards' clumsy magic only made things worse. The Einar Priestess Grace introduced waypoints as a great integration of Venelux magic. Teleportation was a rare skill that was only used by a few wizards. When the wizard Clay completed the schema for waypoints, it enabled anyone to teleport freely. Can I help you? Um, do you need something from the master?
In the apothecary at the Golden Rye Pastures works the always gloomy Oliver Tiller, the herbalist's apprentice. Oliver has been an apprentice there for some time, though he has yet to gain the approval of his master. The farmers pitied the outstanding apprentice, a gifted student who could memorize the names of countless medicinal herbs, but suffered under his eccentric master. Ingredients for rancid powder can be acquired from harvesters and insects in the golden rye pastures. They are the decomposed heart of a harvester, which controls magical power, a wasp stinger, which controls magical toxicity, and a contaminated scarab horn, which has a tonic effect. These ingredients are highly toxic on their own, but highly effective together. Welcome to Mandrick Farmstead, where we grow them with love from seed to harvest. <laughs> if it's fresh mandrakes you need, you've come to the right farm. Ah. Oh my. Uh, I've just run out of roots. Mm. 
How about collecting as many as you need yourself? And, in exchange, you can have everything for free. Then, try harvesting the roots from the mandrakes planted out in the field. Oh, by the way, mandrakes will turn violent when you try to harvest their roots, so be extra careful. <laughs> While you search for treasures hidden in ships wrecked by storms and chests that have been drifting, you will encounter the masters of the coastline. From a distance, they look like normal crustaceans, but when you get up close, you'll find they pose a greater threat than you anticipated. brings you here. Huh? These are the ingredients needed to make rancid powder. Martinet must have sent you. But how did you know about these ingredients? Oliver, that clever boy. How did he figure this out already? He's quite bright. Herbalists have to go to perilous places to acquire ingredients. But Oliver can't even stand the sight of a mere ant. I'm waiting for him to overcome his fears. Well, I'll make the rancid powder for you right away. It must be urgent for you to come all the way out here. But look at me, rambling on. Here's your rancid powder. Planning to go straight back to Martinet? In that case, why don't you try opening your map and teleporting to Castleton?
Ah, looks like it's your first time using a waypoint. If you place your hand on a waypoint, the schema will be activated and the stone will glow blue. Open your map and select a waypoint activated with blue light. You will be instantly transported to that location. Once you place your hand on a waypoint, it will glow with blue light, activating the schema. If you open the map and select an activated waypoint, you can instantly travel to that location. You're back. Did you get some rancid powder? Good work. The rancid powder you brought is excellent in quality. I'll make the mono calming potion for you right away. It is vitally important that you keep Martinez's presence All right. here a secret. Here you are. Why don't you try it and see how it works? Just as I thought, it's much more effective. I tried to improve the efficacy, but I didn't expect the results to be this good. The calming potion's effect is very effective this time. I need to bring this to my sister right away. But as you know, I'm in no position to be wandering around outside. Oh, thank you so much. I made this potion earlier and used the same method to make it once more. Please pass it on to my sister's friend, Mina Pai. Only Mina knows where my sister is. She told me to come find her at Windhill Shores if I ever needed to give my sister something. Go there to find Mina's trail. The effect of the mana calming potion that Martinet made was incredible. Soon after you drank the potion, you could feel your magic begin to settle down. Martinet, who had been researching a way to relieve her older sister Adriana's pain for so long, finally succeeded in creating a potion more effective than her other attempts. Take a gander before you head off on your adventure. Oh, do you need something? Is there anything you want to buy? I'm Nos, contract manager for Castle. I'm Nos. Come on in and look around. 
Toyo friend. If you need a weapon you can count on, you've come. You can ask me anything about weapons, my friend. Anything else you'd like to see? help you. The news from Mina Pai was unexpected. Adriana had ventured far away to avoid the Arkham Legion, who had discovered her hideout. She said that no matter how effective her potions were, they never lasted long enough. Adriana set out to find a way to completely soothe the tempestuous mana. You have a star fragment just like that girl. 
I won't be going home empty-handed after. You dare interfere with our plans? I'll kill you! I can't forget that horrible nightmare I had. So many people in despair, all of them writhing in pain. With time, my memories became clearer. It's agonizing, but I just can't give up. At the very least, for Martinet's sake. I felt someone's presence in my sleep. I thought it was just Mina at first, but then I could tell from the heavy footsteps that the intruder was someone I didn't know. I quickly hid myself and watched the intruder pass by. The pattern engraved on their sword meant that they were part of the Archeum Legion. Just why are the Archeum looking for me again? I can't allow that tragedy to be repeated. It's probably time for me to leave. At the very least, Martinet will be safe. The Archeum Legion attacked the lighthouse where Adriana had been hiding, seeking the power of a star fragment. Only after defeating them did you discover her research papers and a diary she had left behind. There, she had clearly recorded the difficult times she had been through. Just who was Janice Carter anyway? She recognized my power immediately, and knew that as long as I possessed it, I would be targeted by Archeum for the rest of my life. She ended up telling me that the only way to truly be free from the Archeum was to leave as soon as possible, and find some way to gain control over my power. You found a piece of parchment that looked like a letter. The letter contained details about Janice Carter, someone Adriana had met. Janice? Recognizing the strength of the Star Fragment, advised her that the only way to be free from the Archeum was to leave as soon as possible and find a way to control her power.
Archean forces captured Martine, the younger of two twin sisters. By keeping her hostage, they forced the shaman Adriana, who wielded the power of a star fragment, to call forth the rains. As the ritual began, rain cascaded from the sky, accompanied by crashes of thunder. But the Archean forces had altered the ritual. Their tampering caused a cursed rain to fall on Laslin. Wherever the rain fell, creatures transformed into violent monsters that attacked people and devastated the farmland. Adriana was shocked to witness what she had done. When the Archean forces turned on the sisters, meaning to kill them now that they had served their purpose. The awe-inspiring power of the star fragment that lay dormant within Adriana flooded out and their enemies were annihilated in an instant. In the aftermath, Adriana was beset by unspeakable disfigurations, swallowed by guilt over her role in causing the cursed rain. In the past, Adriana had unleashed the cursed rain under the... Is there someone out there? Can anyone help me? There isn't that much time left. Oh, what should I do? There's something that I desperately need, but no one will even listen to me. Couldn't you find it in your heart to help me out, adventurer? Have you ever heard of this monster known as Iskael the Greyfanged? He was this dreadful wolf that possessed terrible malvescence. Back in my younger days, I almost ended up getting killed by Iskael. The only reason I'm alive to speak to you about this today is that Henry, the Lord's son, came to rescue me and the other children. He heroically sacrificed his own life to defeat Iskael. Whenever I get the chance, I try to visit Henry's grave in Castleton Abbey to leave some offerings. Last time, I made some gloves for him using the hide of a rabbit that I caught. The anniversary of Henry's death is coming soon, so I'd like to prepare a special gift for his grave. I saw a beautifully crafted keepsake at an old hunter's house once. He said he got it from participating in the wolf hunting contest that is held in Henry's memory. I wish I could get one of those keepsakes and bring it to Henry's grave, but I'm still too young to participate in the contest. 
you don't mind? You'll really get one of those keepsakes for me? If that's the case, then I... No, never mind. Actually, it would be nice if I could have two of these keepsakes. Do you think it'd be possible to get two? Thank you so much, adventurer! The contest is hosted at the Lord's Residence in Castleton. Go there and ask how you can participate. Brother, this way! Come over here for a second! So many things to do. Making arrangements for the contest, checking up on the farm. I know that you've come a long way, but our situation is pretty bad. We might even have to shut down the contest at this rate. We must lure the wolves to proceed with the contest, but the bait we've been using just isn't working. Lord Hobbs cherishes this contest. He hasn't missed a single one. You have no idea how much trouble I'll be in if this year's event falls flat. Oh, um, wait. If you're here for the contest, can you please help me? I need some ingredients to make a new kind of bait. A wolf hunter keepsake. But that's... Um, no, never mind. But first, you need to help me procure the ingredients needed for the bait. Oh, please defeat the crackle in the wrecks on Windhill Shores. They're tricky to find, but the wolves love eating them. The stench of crackle meat is irresistible bait for beasts like them. Also, investigate any chests that are left in the wrecks. They often contain fishing bait, which is quite effective as well. Please remember, Crackle are difficult prey to hunt, so you should equip at least uncommon level armor. But why don't you pay a visit to Armor Crafter Rachel? I've already... So heavy.
Unfortunate accidents often happen off the coast of Castleton, when fishing boats are sunk by the perilous reefs. Chunks of the bait the anglers use are sometimes found in the chests that wash ashore from the wreckage. Their pungent smell is highly effective at luring in wolves. Crustaceans, called crackles, are often found in the wrecks near Windhill Shores. Crackles are as ferocious as they look and have a pungent smell. It's said that a hunter once won the wolf hunting contest by secretly using crackle meat as bait.
When you returned with the ingredients, the Lord's aide was greatly relieved that he could proceed with the contest as intended. He asked you to deliver the new bait to the Lord's brother, Chris, in Black Owl Plains. He also is the head of the Wolf Hunters Association, so you'll need to talk to him to acquire a keepsake. This vast plain was once a cherished village landmark, before the packs of giant wolves appeared. Now, even seasoned hunters avoid it. Those who trespass into the realm of savage beasts must prepare to face death. <laughs> 